The cell cycle, stage 1, G1, growth or gap phase. The cell at this stage is still young and it undergoes rapid growth. The cell attains its normal size. Organelles are formed. Proteins are produced, such as the enzymes needed in S phase. This is the longest phase in the most cells. Cells that are not dividing muscle and nerve cells remain at this stage throughout their life cycle. Go. Stage 2. Synthesis phase. The DNA, the main composition of the chromosomes inside the nucleus of the cell, doubles at this stage by a process called replication. At the end of this stage, each chromosome is made up of two sister chromosomes attached at the central mirror. Okay. Stage 3. G2 phase or growth. Preparations for cell division. Assembly of proteins such as microtubules, which are hollow protein fibers that can cause, that can cause the assembly of protein chromosomes to move during cell division. Stage 4, M phase, mitosis or meiosis. The cell undergoes division. Division of the nucleus is called karyokinesis, while division of the cytoplasm is called kytokinesis. Stages of mitosis. Stage 1, prophase. During the prophase stage, the long and thread-like chromatids during the interface start to coil and become visible under a compound microscope as individual chromosomes. Each chromosome at this stage contains two identical sister chromatids. The result of DNA synthesis, the membrane of the nucleus, nuclear membrane, dissolves and the spindle fibers are formed. Centrioles migrate at opposite poles of the cell. The nucleus disappears from view. Go. Stage 2. Metaphase. During this stage, chromosomes move and align themselves at the center of the cell called metaphase plate. Spindle fibers connect each chromosome on its centromere to the centrals located at the opposite poles. Stage 3. Anaphase. During this phase, the proteins that bind the two sister chromatids of each chromosome divide. This will be followed by the movement of the separated chromosomes towards opposite poles due to the shortening of the spindle fibers. Stage 4. Telophase. During the telophase, the chromatids, now called chromosomes, are located on opposite poles. Nuclear membrane forms around the chromosomes which start to uncoil. The spindle fibers dissolve and disappear. It is important to note at this point that each chromosome in the daughter cell is composed only of one chromatid. After the division of the nucleus, karyokinesis, the cytoplasm starts to divide. A process called cytokinesis, cytokinesis in animal cells and other cells that lack cell walls, it starts at the exterior of the cell moving inwards until the cell is divided into two cells. This process is called cleavage furrow formation in plant cells and the other cells with cell wall. Cytokinesis starts at the middle of the cell and moves outward by a process called plate formation.